Hi guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. In today's video, I will tell you the difference between opacity and fill opacity and where you can find fill options in Affinity Photo. If you are using Adobe Photoshop or use it before switching to Affinity Photo, you must have seen this fill option often in Adobe Photoshop. It's located below opacity in layer panel. And if you can't find this fill option, in Affinity Photo, don't worry, you're in the right video. I will show you where it's located. Okay, so then for the room, let's open up Affinity Photo and get started. So, I will use this background from Asplash as an example. And let's create a text to show you the difference. Okay, so what is the difference between opacity and fill opacity? This question is one of the most frequently asked questions, not just from beginners, but for some advanced users as well. Okay, so both of the opacity and fill opacity controls a layer's transparency. So this is opacity. You can set the value here. And for fill opacity, let me show you where it's located. So, go to layer effects and you will see fill opacity below here. So, it's located right here. Okay, so now let's for this layer, let's set the opacity to 25%. And for this layer, let's set the fill opacity to 25% as well. Okay, so if you see it like this, you cannot tell the difference between opacity and fill opacity. As you can see, there's no difference, right? So let me tell you, the main difference between opacity and fill opacity has to do with layer effects, okay? So let's set the value back to 100%. And let's apply some layer effects to both of these layers. I will apply outline. And for this layer as well. Let's make this one bigger. Okay, and use blue color for this layer. So now let's Set the opacity for this layer to 25. For opacity, there's no difference. Okay, and for this layer, let's set the fill opacity to 25%. Okay, so now I think you can see the difference, right? So for opacity, if we reduce the opacity we have made everything on this layer becomes transparent okay including the layer effects but for the fill opacity only the text itself becomes transparent it didn't affect the layer effects so that was the difference between opacity and fill opacity so opacity controls everything on the layer and fill opacity it only affect the actual content for this video it is text and it doesn't affect the layer effects okay so that's it for this video i hope now you know the difference between opacity and fill opacity and i hope you enjoy and learn something new from this video hit the like button if you like this video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next video.